my meeting with Jimmy Dean occurred in 1953, somewhere in the spring. And uh, I was aware of him, of course. And I was driving on Sunset Boulevard west toward Life Magazine's offices. They had a photo lab. And I was going there to make the early run. So it was approximately 8 in the morning. And passing through Crescent Heights Boulevard, green light, coming down the other way, crossing the red light, was a crazy guy on a motorcycle. Anyway, he jammed on his brakes, I jammed on mine, and I avoided killing him probably by a few inches. But anyway, he got up off the bike and had a dopey grin, Look, had a dopey grin at me. I was cursing him using every expletive I could think of. And uh, that dopey grin did it, I guess. And we became friends right there. We both went for breakfast at, Go at not Googie's, at uh, Schwab's drugstore. And, of course, by this time I knew who he was. And that's where we made arrangements to meet at the Goldwyn Studio, where I had a, um, a um, gallery set up to make portraits for of Brando and Sinatra. And he did come there. Sinatra and Brando did not come there. So therefore I had the opportunity of making those uh, whimsical portraits, you might say, of Dean. Just fooling around because the two people I was waiting for did not come.